So leg two, race 16 on your card. It's a uh, four mile two version of the Moore's Millions. So number one is Bottas for James Follis, Ellis Rich for Carl Araganti, Great Noise for Kevin Meanhand, Jawala Scarlet for Doug Warren, Master Marthias Marthas for Ponty Paul, Rumfrey for Leon Van Renzo, Spring Jamaican for Stu Gray, Sword Lake for Jim Murray, Trickshot Trev for Paul Rhodes, Zell Stupo for Darren Thompson, Berdolini for Obi Wan, Black Sand Fade in Molly at Surfer, Daryl Lavoie for Martin Liedem, Ekier for Alex Cherry, Misrepresenting for John, and Pray for Your Queen for Joshua. The star has got him awake. Over this uh, marathon, which is obviously the Grand National Distance, and they're through the first, and the one that went, went bashing through it was great noise of Kevin Meanham, but he's just being pushed along to lead with Ellis Rich. They get to the second, he gets over that one much better, and the rest do with a very slow jump at the rear by Spring Jamaican. So the three that are going to lead us is great noise, misrepresenting an Ellis Rich. Get over the third. It's a little bit of a challenge here for misrepresenting, which is we are hilt up stables front run up. Desperate to take the lead from Great Noise and Ellis Rich. And then they're about three lengths ahead of the remaining pack. It's just being led at the moment by Master Marthas and Pray for Your Queen on the inside. Oh no, sure, that's Trick Shot Trev. On the outside of Trick Shot Trev is Pray for Your Queen. Jim Sword Lake, and a length or so back to Zell Stupo, Black Sand Fading, Verdolini's in there, and Orange Silks of Dirius Lavoie, and we'll get over the fourth, and there's Ekier, Run Free, Bottas, and then Spring Jamaican's also in there. So up front is misrepresenting, let's manage to take the lead, let's try and do it all from the front, by a couple of lengths to Great Noise, and then Ellis Rich. A pack of Pray for Your Queen, Sword Lake, Trick Shot Trev. Master Marthas is there. And then a couple of links back to Berdelloni. So Stupo. Take the fifth. Oh, we've lost one there. On fact, lost two. Black Sand Fading gone. And Spring Jamaican. Both unseated their riders towards the rear. Bad luck to connections on both. That's Molly Itz and myself. So it's misrepresented. Takes them to the six. Gets over it. Jump there by uh, Master Marthas. Jockey just managed to stay in the plate. And approach the seventh, the ditch. Leaders are over it. And the remainder, but a poor jump again there by, I think that was Ekier, towards the rear for Alex Cherry. Misrepresenting. Happy to bowl along in the front. Pace is what you'd expect over four miles. Misrepresented by a couple of lengths to Great Noise, and then a couple of further back to Ellis Rich, and then Trick Shot Trev, they're in a line one, two, three, four. They get over the eighth, and it's still misrepresenting. I hope uh, people didn't take too much offence to my compl constant complaining yesterday about uh, Paul Rhodes winning a, a handicap off of uh, 94. After re listening to the comms, I did seem to go on a little bit, so I apologise. You're more than welcome to take a handicap, Paul. Although I'm a great believer, if you run a graded race, I think uh, your handicap should be stung, whatever. I don't think you should really, if you come fifth in a, in a, a group race or a graded race, you should really uh, be penalised for running in a graded race. But that's my personal opinion. As we know, I like to moan about handicapping. But up front, Great Noises uh, joined misrepresenting now, as they're both going to take uh, the winning post together. But I would have thought two more circuits to go. And there they go, neck and neck. And there's about five lengths on that uh, trick shot Trev and Ellis Rich. And Master Marthas, a length or so back to Salt Lake and Pray for Your Queen. A further lengths back to Deria Lavoie, Berdelloni, Rum Free, Zestupo is against the fence in the blue suits with the white sleeves. And a couple back to Rum Free. And then Bottas, Jawala, Scarlet, and Ekier. So they're over the 12th, and they're all still on it. And it's misrepresented in from Great Noise. Ellis Rich is in third. And we've got Pray for Your Queen, Master Marthas, and Chick Shot Travel together. Outside of them is Rum Free in the blue silks. Coming back inside of those are Birdie, Birdaloni, Deria Lavoie. 
ones that are just a little bit disconnected are Bottas, Joanna Secret and Ekier at the moment. But misrepresenting, great noise. Get to the 13th together. Touchdown together. Misrepresenting was just probably a stride ahead. And we've still got over two miles to travel. And it's misrepresenting from great noise. To the 14th, only halfway through the fences. All over that, although one that took a dive at it was Sword Lake. It was out wide in the black silks. So we pecked on landing. Into the 15th, the leaders take it. Everyone else, oh no, Nekier's gone there. Didn't see the fall up, but uh, he was towards the rear. A little bit tired, and uh, he's now out of the race. And I can't tell, there's Juwala Secret just nosing in. He's got the tail and Charlie position as we speak. But it's misrepresenting again. It's taken it up by a length. Well, he has got company. There's about four back to Ellis Rich. Always been there. Martha's Master Martha's. We go over the 16th. A few slower jumps now. The horse is starting to get a little bit tired. They've got still another 11 fences to jump. And it's misrepresenting from great noise. Oh, we're losing one there. Poor old Joala Secret's had enough. Being pulled up out in the back of the course. He's got a long old slog back to the stables. Unlucky Darn, we lost the only one that was seen to be challenging the leader has gone. Great noise. Slipped his jockey on wall and Jo Oh no, we know Joala Secret's already been pulled up. We get to the 18th and the leader's still leading. Poor jump there by Berdiloni. Notes himself into last position. The 19th, lead is over it. Oh, we lost the hunt. Berdiloni's gone there, jumped the last ball. So, uh, getting cut back here, six down. Uh, there's four miles and two furlongs. And I think we'll have just one more circuit to go. Misrepresented him, takes the winning post from Pray for Your Queen. Ellis Rich run free. And got a line of Zell Stupo, Master Martha's, Derrière Lavoie, Sword Lake. Just two at the rear now as Trick Shop Trev has demoted himself and Bottas. So misrepresenting. It's to the 20th. Gets over it well, a bit slower. They're getting much closer to him now. Just a length back to pray for your queen. Pray for the queen. And then Ellis Rich and run free. And a length or so back to Master Martha. So Stupo, Saul Bake, Derry Lavoie still there. Trick Shop Trev and Bottas. Represent and leads, leads them to the next. We're inside the final mile at last. And it's misrepresenting by a length or so to pray for your queen. Run free, Ellis Rich. We get to the 21st. Everybody jumps it. Misrepresenting just being pushed along a little bit now. Six and a half furlongs still to travel. One running quite well is pray for the queen. And that side of that is run free. And out of the pack, here comes Trick Shot Trev to make a challenge. So, it's misrepresenting. Trick shot Trev off the bridle and being really pushed along now. Try and catch up. Still got five and a half furlongs to go. Both rise over the 23rd and it's Trick shot Trev that gets away from it better. Takes up the lead by a good couple of lengths now. Misrepresenting may not have anything left. Rum free still running on, but they're all off the bridle now. Pray for the Queen. Zell Stupa making a bit of ground up in the center of the pack. Out wider still is Sword Lake. Derry Lavoie's pushing on. The last two are Bottas and Ellis Rich, but it's Trickshot Trev that's got a five, six length advantage now as he gets to the 24th, takes it well. As to the rest, and he's got five, six length, six length advantage now from Zell Stupo. Rum free, misrepresenting, trying to cut back into their own. Pray for the Queen didn't, hasn't uh, picked up as much as we imagined, but Trickshot Trev Jockey has a little look round. I think he thinks he's got a lot more left. We've got two and a half furlongs left to run. A couple to jump. He's over the 25th. So two to go. And it's Trick Shot Trev from Run Free and Zell Stupo. Not many left in this now. And it's Trick Shot Trev running on. Gets over the penultimate. Jumps it well. Run Free and Zell Stupo as well. I'm not sure anything's going to be able to catch this in this muddy old rain here. And it's Trick Shot Trev with a furlong left to go. Get over the last. He does. As does Run Free and Zell Stupo. Pray for the Queen. And the last slow jump there. And it's Trick Shot Trev is going to take this very, very comfortably in the end. Jackie just uh, giving his horse a couple of reminders. But he's won it cleanly by three to four lengths from Zell Stupo. Run for eight was third. Pray for the Queen fourth, I think. And just bring up the rear there is Ellis Rich. So 
So that's a win for Paul Rhodes. Well done with Trick Shot Trev. Second was El Stupo for Darren Thompson. Third was Run Free for Leon Van Rensburg. Fourth was Pray for the Queen, Joshua Sutherland. And fifth was Salt Lake for Jim Murray.